one of eight. Oh! Oh, congratulations. You know, when she said one of eight, and they did such a good job with her. Me and my wife, Karima, we got three, and they about to drive us up. You know, I'm just being real, you know, she'll tell you that. You know why she does a good job with them. So that, that's even more credit to you all. Next is the Muslim male youth of the year. So you see Imam Muhammad wisdom, his strategy. Yes. And next year, we should be aspiring next year to see who will be the Muslim man of the year. I'm looking forward to it in 2013. Who will be the Muslim woman of the year in 2013? Who will be the Muslim male youth of the year and the Muslim youth female of the year? for next year, 2013, about that. It may be one of our young people, some of you sitting right in this audience here today, about that. This next person, individual, we know very, very well, and he's here with his mother tonight, and he was selected as the Muslim Male Youth of the Year, Brother Cornell Kitt. And, inshallah, if you would read his vow and profile, we would greatly appreciate it. And I pray to Allah that all of you understand that the reason why, as we mentioned, that we are not reading all of the, the uh, vows and profile, it would just take too long. It would take too long. But it does not diminish or take away from the wonderful people cheating it at all. So, Brother Quinnell, will you please just come forward? This is a remarkable human being, a remarkable person, and he'll tell you his story, and then maybe his mother might be able to say some words just to introduce him, just to do that, you know, how you want to do it, and everything. But we are honored to give this award to Brother Quinnell Pitt. For love name, the merciful, Benefactor, the Mercy Redeemer. The Mars Cares Ministry of WD Muslim, 2012 Annual Muslim Convention, Muslim Male Youth of the Year. Wow, that's God. For your outstanding dedication, determination, commitment, and struggle in the cause of Al Islam. September 1st, 2012. W.D. Muhammad's second president. Congratulations. You earned this, brother. Congratulations. I thank you on behalf, I thank the Moss Cares, Imam Kareem, and the Council of Imams. Uh, on behalf of my son, he's going to say a few words of his own, but I do implore you to please read his bio. This is a magnificent young man by the mercy and grace of Allah. And I don't say this just because he's my son, I'm a tad bit biased. <laughs> but he is a, a humble young man, a humble spirit. And just to give you a little bit of his background, you, you'll read more in his bio. But at age 17, we discovered that Cornell had MS. He's 25 years old now. Uh, he had multiple sclerosis, which is a devastating illness. And um, Cornell has discovered and has turned that into a plus, into a benefit. Uh, he, he now, and some of you will hear it tomorrow when he does give a few brief words, uh, a little bit of a speech, that he has now renamed MS and taken away the name multiple sclerosis and named it Many Skills. <laughs> I would have to concur, a remarkable young man, a mar remarkable accomplishment, and we, we thank Allah mightily for him and, uh, and his soul of a thousand soldiers, because he does. Uh, gets, he gets through this, this tremendous, devastating, uh, over and he overcomes it. He overcomes it instead of succumbing to it. And uh, I'll let him say a few words. He is a little tired now, it's been a long day, yes. and one of the uh, effects of the MS is that it does make him very weak after a while. So he's been a trooper all these hours. We've been here since 5.30. <laughs> so um, so he's doing well, but please bear with him as he just reads his few comments because he does have some issues with his short-term memory, but he can sure remember stuff a long time ago like an elephant. <laughs> but 
bear with them, uh, sisters and brothers, and inshallah, um, for now we now say a few words. Assalamu alaikum. I just want to thank the mosque head and the council of Amen for allowing me to honor the allowing me the privilege to speak tonight. I I really can't imagine. Receiving an award for living the way the Quran says to live. Allah. Allah. I am extremely grateful for receiving Thank you. 